What it do, YouTube? It's your boy BC, the King of Long Beach, and it's Biscuit. <laughs> What's up? I'm bringing y'all some headquarters, the actual, real factual, fastest way to level up. But what's up? It's your boy BC, man. I'm uh, yeah, bringing y'all my first actual commentary, I believe. I might be mistaken, of a headquarters game. Um, I know I played headquarters modern warfare 2 i might have did a commentary on that but anyway it's irrelevant uh, you know what i'm gonna get off topic for a sub for a second <clears throat> i think i might try out for the cleveland cavaliers next season man because without lebron them dudes is horrible and the reason i say that is the laker game's going on right now and then we're up by about 50 53 or some shit and it's ridiculous but anyway Back to the gameplay. I'm using the Commando, which is the Blops ACR. You know what I mean? This is the Blops ACR. And as you can see, it it still has recoil. And you'll see a couple times in the gameplay that, yeah, I'm not all that great as far as aiming. <laughs> and a little bit of recoil can throw me off. And I tend not to use this gun because I don't want to, uh, you know, cater to my weakness, basically. You know what I'm saying? I don't want to use one of the straightest shooting guns when I can't aim. I still want to use the difficult games to try to improve on my bad aim. So, before, hold on, before I get any comments or messages, BC, you're not playing objectives and you're not capturing the headquarters. I'm slaying and I don't got to play the fucking objective if I don't want to. So, let's get that out of there. Nah, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a slayer this game. Slayer slash defender. I'm not actually defending the flag. I'm just keeping the other team. It ain't a flag. The, the headquarters. I'm just keeping the other team from getting the headquarters. So my team always captures it. And uh, I'm just being a nuisance to the other team by controlling this building. And uh, you don't want to really want to camp with a motion sensor. What you want to do is you want to use it to patrol area or watch your ass. A motion sensor is better than a claymore because sometimes you can't hide them good enough to where the other team doesn't really know that it's there. And uh, I'm going to give you guys a perfect example. I'm not sure if I'm going to upload this next gameplay, you know, uh, example how to spawn trap and free for all with a motion sensor. I mean, if you can get a motion sensor hidden good enough, it's, it's ridiculously uh, effective. So, yeah, I'm just up in this building. I'm going to fast forward all the boring parts because as we know, headquarters is long as fuck. I think I actually fell asleep during the headquarters game before. Woke up and we still won. <laughs> it was that long. I mean, it, they averaged about 15 to 18 minutes. And I believe this one was a 13, 14 minute headquarter game. And, uh, oh, don't look at that. My finger slipped off the controller right there. So I don't know. What <laughs> That's my story and I'm sticking to it. My finger slipped off the controller. And I let the guy in second chance kill me because I said, fuck it. He already, you know, he was crawling around on his back pleading for mercy. So I went ahead and let him kill me. But anyway, yeah, I just. What the hell was I talking about? <laughs> Brain fart. <laughs> I'm in a goofy mood right now, man. As you can see, I just finished watching. Or actually, I am still am to my left watching the Laker game. And uh, we've emptied our benches. We're up by 50. It's just ugly for Cleveland. Was LeBron really that, like, really that good for their franchise? Like, they can't win a game without them? This is ridiculous. They all getting paid millions. Throw BC in the game. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to build, with my first check, I'm going to build the ultimate, the ultimate gaming session for my, or station for my subs. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to put 100 flat screen. Now, let me stop dreaming. Do y'all ever... Have those lottery dreams like what you would do with if you won a lottery but uh sorry for y'all in utah y'all don't have the lottery out there and that's y'all fault that's y'all bad but anyway <laughs> back to the gameplay man i i end up achieving what i want to do which was kill whore you know i like keeping it real i don't like to like sugarcoat the shit that i'm doing it's obvious that i'm staying far away from the target and the headquarters you know just to uh you know basically patrol the map I'm I, out of at least 30 games of headquarters we probably only lost three within the last few days so you know I'm not really concerned with losing the game so I said let me go ahead and build some air support I'm trying to catch my boy Danky Nugs 
with chopper gunner kills he has like at least four or five hundred more than me right at this moment and i'm like three prestigious higher than him so that lets you know the boy is a straight fucking beast and uh i called both of the chopper gunners in back to back i thought maybe that would help me you know what i'm saying get uh maximize the kills because you know, if they're not shooting them down, you know, maybe they'll just be spawning in one area and then I'll come with the second one. But it didn't work out like that. Once I got out the first chopper gunner, I seen that I was in a dumb spot to call the second one in. So I ran into those two clowns, got me a quick little double kill. And I, I'm going to go in this little building, camp it out and call my next chopper gunner in. Of course, I'm going to fast forward it. But headquarters is actually the fastest way to level up unless you're like a dumb beast at the game then i would say search and destroy go and search and destroy get average about 15 kills 10 or 15 kills in search you level up faster than headquarters but after this game oh hold on got to take a moment of silence for this new move and that was a new move look at me run out of bullets oh get laid down why did i chase the dude everybody knows chasing is one of the worst things in, in, in Call of Duty. If you got the shot, take it. But I was trying to be a clown and humiliate the dude and stab him in the back of his fucking head. Give him a close shave up or something. And end up getting my ass laid down because this boy unexpectedly was standing right there. So I shot the closest one to me. And with my horrible aim, I end up using like three quarters of the clip or more. And by the time it was time to, 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 to take the second dude out, I didn't have no ammo. And as you can see, the new moves are setting in. You know what I mean? It's like a, a, a what they call it, a domino effect. Once you do one new move, they just continue on. So I started off the gameplay pretty hot. Ended up getting two chopper gunners and then it went downhill from there. But I still want to upload the gameplay because I'm one that believes that you don't have to play the objectives to win. But you do have to know what the hell you're doing and have the right team and support to win. So... I know that my team's good enough to, to uh, capture the headquarters so I can run around and clown around, you know what I mean, and have fun. This is just one of those enjoy yourself, don't worry about winning or losing because we're going to win anyway we're just playing news. But, you know, it's just one of those type games and I just wanted to bring it to you guys to show you that you actually get tons of points. Like The points pop up on the screen so much when we have the headquarters. If I'm shooting it out, sometimes it'll throw me off. I'll actually think that the 50 points popped up was me actually killing the other dude. But sometimes I'm fucking... I hate it, man, because I'll be in a shootout and the 50 points will pop up and I'll stop shooting. Thinking that I got the kill and lo and behold, it was just me getting points for having the headquarters and the other guy to kill me. So I think this was the only time that we let them capture the headquarters. And I think we did it purposely just to drag the game out a little more. You know I mean, we. I mean, headquarters is like the easiest game type when you're playing with a party. Honestly, like domination can flip on you fast because it spawns and uh, you know, air support. You know what I mean? Air support is 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 a big factor in domination. But when you're playing headquarters, play with a party, you'll win 90% of your games as long as everybody's decent players. So I'm gonna be bringing you guys some more spotlight videos. I got to spotlight the homegirl player do wrong, man. She's She's been putting up some B scores. Uh, shout out to Miss Merck. You know what I mean? This is another female that uh, I've been playing with as of late. She's a pretty decent player. She got a nice mouth on her. She argued with my homeboy for a whole entire game. So I was about to mute both of them. But I enjoyed the way she, she stood up for herself. So we ended up letting her play with our party for the rest of the evening. And I've actually gamed with her a couple more times. So shout out to her. Um, shout out to all the female gamers out there. It is actually some good fucking females out there that will embarrass you. Like, really, like, Shy City will embarrass a player, you know. But shout out to all the female gamers and uh, play headquarters. I'm almost on 12 prestige. I only got, like, nine more levels to go, and I'll be 12 prestige. Hopefully, within a week and a half, two weeks, I'll be 14 prestige so I can get those gold guns. Because I'm a gold gun fanboy. I actually pick up gold guns when I see them laying around. Just because the fucking gold gun just looks sick. But uh, my final score ended up being 55 and 9. And headquarters is the fastest way to level up. So there it is. Hope you guys enjoyed. Your boy BC trying to bring some versatility to this game. 
enjoy me enjoy what i bring to the table enjoy nls y'all take it easy youtube signing out peace To stay updated with Next Level Studios, be sure to follow us on Twitter and like us on Facebook. There you'll find the latest and greatest news from Next Level Studios.